Welcome to this detailed overview of SCPYYYY, commonly referred to as the man. Item number SCPYYYY is classified as Keter, indicating that it poses a significant threat and is extremely difficult to contain. Special containment procedures for SCPYYYY are complex due to its immense power and unpredictability. Direct containment is currently deemed impossible. Instead, the focus is on monitoring SCPYYYY's appearances and minimizing potential risks. Any sightings or interactions with SCPYYYY must be reported immediately to the O5 Council. Personnel are instructed to avoid direct contact and to evacuate the area if SCPYYYY manifests. SCPYYYY appears as a large, humanoid figure, often accompanied by a young child designated as SCP-YYYY-1. The man possesses virtually unlimited power, including but not limited to reality manipulation, teleportation, and instant materialization. SCPYYYY has demonstrated the ability to erase entities from existence as seen in the incident involving SCP-096. The first documented appearance of SCP-YYYY involved the retrieval of SCP-ZZZZ, the Do Book. During this event, SCP-YYYY and SCP-YYYY-1 emerged from a portal, immobilized all personnel present, and vanished with the book, leaving behind a note that stated, you can have this copy of the Do Book, The Man. SCPYYYY's actions suggest a level of omnipotence and omniscience. It has shown the ability to manipulate reality on a fundamental level, making it one of the most powerful entities encountered. Its motivations remain unclear, and its actions appear to be driven by whims rather than any discernible pattern or goal. Despite its immense power, SCPYYYY has not exhibited overtly malicious behavior. However, its unpredictability and capability to alter reality pose a significant threat, justifying its Keter classification. SCPYYYY-1, the child often seen with the man, does not have a designated object class but would be considered safe if classified. SCP-YYYY-1 appears to be an ordinary child with no anomalous properties, though its association with SCP-YYYY warrants close observation. Researchers continue to study SCP-YYYY to better understand its abilities and potential vulnerabilities. The primary goal is to develop strategies for mitigating any potential threats posed by SCP-YYYYs unpredictable nature. Thank you for watching this comprehensive overview of SCPYYYY, The Man. Stay tuned for more in-depth explorations of SCP anomalies.